Hey guys, so today I thought it'd be interesting if you see me live coding on a Darwin machine uh, a new feature for my upload script. So if you remember, I I um, I had made a video about maybe uploading to S3 and and while I make movies, I do want to, I think I do want to back them up to S3 because I don't want these um, these basically these movie projects to clog up my limited SSD space on, on, on the MacBook Pro here. By the way, yeah, I'm, I'm using my, I prefer to work on my, my Arch Linux machine, but I'm actually connecting to this MacBook Pro behind it. I know it's kind of ridiculous. Um, so, yes. Oh, by the way, if you do use Final Cut Pro 10, um, I, I do make it a point that when I've finished the edit, I uh, delete all the generated files to keep this FCB bundle to a minimum. Okay, so I want to back that up to S3. The trouble is my upload script, if I'm if I'm using it, say, on this, just won't work because it only works on um, a single file. So I need to make it work on a directory. So this is what we're going to do, make upload work on a whole directory but the like for example the the projects that Final Cut Pro 10 make here are, contain lots of different little files so we can't realistically um, upload them file by file because they'll be terrible to download them so the trick is here is to make a tar file I believe and upload that so let's just try do what I want to do Ma this is how I work, so so uh, I'm just going to try do something like this. This is what I want to I want to do quickly. And and since we're on, since here we're on a sorry we're on we're on Darwin. I have Brew installed, but I, d I don't think I got the GNU stuff installed. So this is probably going to be tricky because I think uh, macOS is kind of developer hostile, or maybe developer hostile developers are used to like a nice development experience on arch so let's try go for this i am going to create this file terror dodge z um oh yeah i forgot the z there come on this should work so with gzip it shouldn't compress the files all that much um it should just bundle them together hmm this is taking too much time. Okay, forget it. I'm not going to use it. I'm just going to. I'm just going to tar. Oh my gosh! Even tarring takes time. Okay, so what do we have here? Uh, we had this one didn't work out. What? Oh yeah. Yeah. Du minus sh to see what the original size was. One point six. The tar is one. Point six, good, good, good. So the idea is that everything's in one file, so that if you did want to down, uh, uh, download it, you just okay. Let's just test this out. So this is ba -ba boom, ba -ba boom, boom. Uh, yeah, are we going a hundred meg a second? I'm not sure. It's wired. Should be going fast. So, I guess I need to write into my script the tar thing, and then it uploads. And then, shall I do a cleanup? Yeah, I guess I should do a cleanup. Yeah, okay, let's just implement this now. Oh no, I need to get a bigger one going for you guys. I need a bigger one. Okay, here we go, here we go. So, where is my upload script at present? Oh, it's chugging along here. I don't know. Everything's broken on a, on a macOS machine. Seems this seems to be normal. Okay, hold on. Uh, okay, that seemed to work, and then I would delete this. Save some space. Well, I should I should kind of test if it actually did work.
well, that uploaded, downloads quicker from S3 than I did to upload. So the idea is like, guys, I, I don't really mind if you if you download my FCB bundles. If I mean, if you could load up my project in your own Final Cut Pro 10 point whatever three, uh, that would actually be heartwarming to me, actually. You know, like, ah, oh, that'd be cool. You can see my data and uh, maybe use it for, for your own project or whatever. Okay, it seems to work. Okay, let's, let's get implementing. Okay, I'm gonna just get rid of the discard stuff. Blah, 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 yeah. So, uh, I know the upload script is here, I think. I'm pretty sure it's here. Uh, here. This is the one. Okay, so um, <laughs> I, don't, I guess I do a test if it's a file. Missing file name, continue. Okay, but if it's a directory, do something else. Uh, mm. I think it's, I should implement it like this. Actually, all that stuff is assuming that it's a file, isn't it? Is this gonna work? Maybe I should get in there earlier. If, okay, if it's a directory, hmm, then you'd like go tar cvf source dot tar source. Yeah. But then the source changes to source dot tar. If okay, uh, oh, blah, blah, blah. if it is a directory, I prefer this if test stuff. This looks nicer to me. The other way is to use those those the square brackets. Uh, I think that should work. But then there's the cleanup operation. Ah, uh, let's do let's not do cleanup today. So let's upload another project, SG Secure One. Da, da, da. Let's see if this works. It's tarring things up. It's uploading things. Kind of slowly. I wonder if it's because it's on what? So sometimes I think. Sometimes I think it's like using wireless. Don't use wireless. Turning Wi-Fi off here. Yeah, that's this seems to be the problem that it's using wireless. The net. Oh, why is this not working? Honestly, come on, USB C, come on. Connected. This is what I mean. Um, yeah. Can't seem to escape from this, so. Mouse. Uh, defender of the universe. Okay, what is this IP address? Another thing, I, I use bonjour.local to connect to things, but sometimes it gets deadly confused when I switch between wireless and wireless. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. 
it gets deadly confused when I switch between wi wireless and wired. Yes, whatever. Uh, uh. Okay. Let's do that again. Let's choose another one. Upload. Thimp Dell. I think it's working. Look at the speed of that. Awesome. That's a hundred megabytes a second. That's one gigabit connection going up there. Even though I do have two, but you can't really get two working easily. Yep. So I can get rid of that. Get rid of that. I have the I have the confidence that I've backed it up. I probably need to do this SG Secure thing one more time. But yeah, so guys, I just implemented a new feature to my upload thing. I'll I'll link um I'll link to the the file in my in the description. I hope you enjoyed uh, this little. Uh, <laughs> tutorial about how to implement something in shell on Darwin and uh, I hope you even use the upload utility uh, and, uh, and and use s3 because it's rather good okay thanks for watching if you know better let me know and uh, please subscribe bye guys so I realized I made a couple of tragic mistakes you see the dot tar file there that's a result of me not base naming the the, the directory name because because the directory name can have a, a, a what do you call it a leading slash. Dumb. So now I'm just fixing that. D <laughs> Charlie, I'm here. Fun and games are over. Oh, looking good. It's working quite nicely. Saving space. Good. And yeah, you guys can download these things too. Let me just quickly show you what I ended up with. <laughs> Okay, bye guys. Mm -hmm.